Shalom, Brother Shema. I want to start giving all praises due to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, and double honors to the apostles pushing this word with sincerity and truth. Brother Shema, I want to give a two headed quitter. I want to start with a Ezekiel 33 and 6. Part Ezekiel 36, verse 6. Ezekiel 36, verse 3. Therefore prophesy and say, Thus says the Lord Yahweh, because they have made you desolate and swallowed you up on every side, that you might be a possession unto the residue of the heathen. And you are taken up in the lips of the talkers and are an infamy of the people. Right. When you look at that word infamy, it means, um, it means goals. It means to go against um, um, reports and rumors, un unfavorable sayings. So that word infamy in Hebrew is the the bar. So it says that <clears throat> that says the Lord, because thy have made you desolate and swallowed you up on every side, that you may be a possession unto the residue of the heathen. And you are taken up in the lips of the talkers and are an infamy of the people. Yeah, the people talk bad about us. All the nations talk bad about us, all right? So let me give you um, another precept to that. It's Wisdom of Solomon, chapter two, verse 12. Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 2, verse 12. Here it is. Therefore, let us lie and wait for the righteous, because he is not for our turn right. When we out there preaching the work, we casting down the lies. We go against those philosophies, against the, the, the doctrine that the world is trying to push out. And then it says, because he is not of our turn, and he is clean, contrary to our doings. Right. We don't want to have nothing to do with their peg, with you, with you pegging on. Um, religions and, and your false philosophies. We're trying to cast that down. You know, and how do we cast that down? We cast that down with the Holy Spirit, which is this word, which is the Bible. That's why Yahweh shall say, he comes in the volume of the book. And then it says, he upbraid us with our offending the law and object to our infamy, the transgression of our education. Yes, right, infamy, the word infamy again in Hebrew is the word. So we reject those rumors. We reject their reports. We reject the things that they say, that the, the things that the world is pushing. We go against that. You know? So that was just a two-headed quitter. You know what I'm saying? Brother Shema, hope you edify. Shalom.